Laura is fed up of being a secret. She is convinced this tale of forbidden love can still have a happy ending. And she wants Ashgar's family to know how she feels about him. On October the 6th, 2010, fueled by alcohol, Laura and Sarah make a fatal decision. They knock on Ashgar's mother's door. We went to the house and um, told Ashgar's family what, what was going on. I think she told Ashjack's mum she wanted like to get married to him, she wanted to have his babies, and obviously she didn't like that with Laura being white. His mum just got abusive, tried to throw shoe at her, well hit her with a shoe. Ashgar is there, standing behind his mother. And Ashjack had come on the scene. I've heard that he, he was just acting right sheepish and his mother telling him to get it out. Ashgar says nothing, so he stays out of it which clearly shows where his loyalty lies. And that's not with Laura. I lost all the respect for him. Never wanted to see him again. Never wanted to talk to him again. I told Laura to stay away as well. This wouldn't have gone down well, as particularly that she was drunk when she was saying this, but more importantly, because it was too visual for the community, for your family, extended family members, to know about that, that is deeply, deeply shameful. The ramifications of being dishonoured in the community are huge. But Laura and Sarah don't appear to realise the implications of their actions. We decided to go to Zach's house and tell his mother about Alicia. She says, I'm sick of her being a secret. Because she had been told she'd not to mention about Alicia to any family. So that's what she did, but they just didn't want to know. Hussein continues to deny that he is the father of Alicia. Forensic psychologist Dr Kerry Nixon has done research into honour-based violence. I think it's important to understand how deep-seated these issues are. There's um, a saying that we have, um, blood is thicker than water, meaning that family is more important than anybody else. There's a saying in communities affected by honour-based violence, and that saying is, honour is thicker than blood. Meaning, to protect the family's honour, to protect the family from being shamed, it is a better option to kill somebody than to bring shame on the family. She'd fetch shame on their family. She had to be stopped.